Today, I'm going to show you a brief demo of a Renesas microcontroller application, Smart Medicine Box. It is a smart weekly pill box designed to help users store set up reminders and record pill taken events for their pills. Supported by smartphone app and cloud technology, the Smart Medicine Box allows users to receive pill reminder notifications, record their medication information, and view pill taking history using the app. The MCU is RL78G13. The bug boost regulator is ISL9120. And there is a buzzer, a vibration motor, a four digit seven segment LED display, an ESPH266 Wi Fi module, three keys and seven LED indicators. Users can choose power supplies from DC power and battery power through the switch. SW1 is used to wake up the system or to stop notifications and upload medication events to the cloud. SW2 is used to make the Wi-Fi module enter AP mode so users can set Wi-Fi ID and password on their smartphones. SW3 is used to stop the power supply of the Wi-Fi module so that the system can enter the power saving mode. The Smart Medicine Box contains seven separate sub-boxes with the seven LED indicators corresponding to each of them. If the reminder has been set, the medicine box will remind users to take pills using light, sound, and vibration. And the current time will be displayed on the 4-digit 7-segment LED. Now let's use DC power supply to power on the system. Once the system is powered on, the preset time will be displayed on the 4-digit 7-segment LED and the LED indicator for the Wi-Fi module will blink every 4 seconds. By now, the medicine box has not been connected to the local area network. First, press SW2 to allow the box entering AP mode. We can see the LED indicator for the Wi-Fi module is blinking every 100 milliseconds. Open the app to set Wi-Fi ID and password to add the smart medicine box or the smartphone. When the medicine box is connected to the local area network and the cloud, the LED indicator for the Wi-Fi module will blink every one second, and the box will adjust time automatically. Up to three reminders can be set for the box, and I will set two for today's demonstration. When the reminder notification occurs, there will be a vibration at the bus with the corresponding LED light being on, and the current time will be displayed on the 4-digit 7-segment LED.
The notification will be released and the modification event will be uploaded to the cloud if SW1 is pressed. If we ignore the reminder, the notification will last for one minute. Now, let's view the record with the Smart Web Box app on my smartphone. We can also clear reminders on the smartphone. Now let's change DC power supply into battery power supply. Click on the time correction button on the app to synchronize the time with the medicine box. Users can check the remaining capacity of the battery or the smartphone when using battery power supply. When the remaining capacity is low, there will be a reminder of battery replacement on the smartphone. Press SW3 to power off the Wi-Fi module to extend the battery life. In this situation, the Maxi box is disconnected from the local area network, and the preset reminders will occur all time. But the medication events won't be uploaded to the cloud.